What's up lads, it's King Langbird here, back with another review on Team of the Season, Fedor Smolov. Before we get into the review, can you please hit the like button if you enjoyed the video, and do not forget to subscribe for more content. Anyway, this guy is 6 foot 2, 4 star weak foot, 3 star skills, and then his stats. 93 pace, 93 shooting, 81 passing, 90 dribbling, 82 physical. Standouts being his 95 acceleration, 96 finishing, 97 attack positioning, 94 shot power, 88 agility there's just so many to choose from loads of high 80 stats and 90s it's just really a well balanced attacking card and his specialities of speedster dribbler distance shooter acrobat clinical finisher complete forward and his traits of finesse shot and long shot taker which traits really came into use later on in this this review but anyway guys let's get into the pros of this card let's start off with his height he's six foot two which is just in my opinion perfect for a striker he's tall enough to win headers and he's not too tall that he's just clumsy four star weak foot this four star weak foot genuinely felt like i at times i knew he was right foot but at times i just thought he was left foot it was just so good his pace with 95 acceleration is just He's rapid. Off the mark, he is just... He hits that 90 sprint speed straight away. Um, his positioning, 97. He's constantly making runs in behind defenders. No instructions required, like get in behind or whatever. He's just always making those runs. His finishing of 96 is really good as well. With the force our weak foot, he can score on both foots inside the box. And it's quite good. Along with the 94 shot power. Each stat kind of like helps each other. Like the force star weak foot... 97 positioning, 96 finishing, 94 shot power. It all helps each other. His finesse shots are incredible. Like I was scoring goals from everywhere, outside the box, inside the box, finesses, not finesses, whatever. Um, he's 90 curve, and he has the finesse shot trait, which kind of really does help him. Um, and his agility, he's 88 agility, and like. That sounds like a lot of positives. This card is really, truly incredible. The goal, like, I played daily knockout tournament for to get the team of the season Kevin Volland card, and I played it earlier on and struggled, like lost in the second round, whatever. Daily knockout tournament just flew it with this card. I like, I played the semi semi final and the final with this card, and semi finally scored me two goals, and the finally scored me a hat trick, and it was just brilliant. Um, few cons, as you can expect, with really most cards and the con is kind of, it's kind of a shame because it's his league and his nation he's being Russian and in the Russian league you can't really put him in many teams unless you have like Quincy Promes or other cards like that in your club but if you have icons then yeah go ahead but with team of the season now everyone wants to try out new cards and it's kind of hard to try out this card in a good team you kind of have to like handicap yourself a little bit putting yourself in a lower team which is not great as you see there that's back to his pros there if it's a finesse shot just Petrick doesn't even get anywhere near it um his three star skills now look it would, for the striker he is he's sort of a target man his passing is excellent loves to lay the ball off so three star skills isn't really like required but it's always nice to have so that's not really like con but just shows the type of card this guy is the fact that I only have two cons which is his league nation and then his three star skills that's all I can say bad about this card and I'm very picky with my cards on Ultra Team like it has to be good for me to give a good opinion on him and this card certainly is it's one of the best strikers I've used since 90 foot swap Ibrahimovic which for me was one of my favourite strikers when he was released or when I could get him from the foot swap took cards um, he's a few decent stats that I just have to mention as well his 86 composure it, it felt a lot higher I actually could put that in his pros as well he um, any time in the box he just finished it 90 minute half time whenever players around him he could just do it under pressure he done it um, his jumping 75 being 6 foot 2 it's not really negative like it's low stat for a 91 rated card but a 6 foot 2 it kind of puts him up to about 6 foot 4 6 foot 5 because it's a it's decent jumping stat not the best but you'll take it with 6 foot 2 and then his aggression which is 75 it's it's good it does like he does win battles um, with his 84 strength it obviously isn't the highest either but he does hold off a lot of challenges Um truly I really enjoyed this card but anyway guys if you enjoyed make sure you hit the like button and do not forget to subscribe see you later